Good morning and welcome to Midwest Adventures. I'm Joe. Staying active may look a little bit different right now, but even flyover country has the safest, easiest, and most accessible ways to get outside. Let's go. Good morning, we got a big day planned. We're riding from Des Moines all the way up to Ames. Let's go. First, we have to navigate the Des Moines Metro, which is actually pretty easy. There's a large network of bike lanes, walking paths, and other paved trails too. It makes it super easy to get around. These network of trails follow the Des Moines, Raccoon, and Walnut Creek rivers. This trail network extends as far east as Baxter and as far west as Perry. We just got off the Neil Smith Trail, which runs all the way from downtown. But I think I need a little bit of a break. Let's stop here. Here we are at Jester Park, right on beautiful Sailorville Lake. This huge lake offers a lot of cool activities, boating, fishing, camping. And the best part is, this lake is only about 20 to 30 minutes from Des Moines. Just a little bit farther than Sailorville is Big Creek. And that's where we are now. This No Wake Lake is super awesome for all the non-motorized water sports. Kayaking, sailboating, paddle boarding, all of the above. And if you don't have a boat, they do have a pretty big fleet of boats to rent uh, for the day or even longer too. All right, we're leaving Big Creek now and we're on to Slater. But we're saying goodbye to the bike paths and hello to some beautiful country roads. Let's get going. And we have arrived at our destination, almost literally in the shadow of Jack Trace Stadium. This is Stuart Smith Park up in Ames. That's just a little of what Iowa has to offer while remaining socially distanced, of course. Join us in two weeks where we check out some more places in the Midwest. And if you guys have any questions about our route today, uh, please hit us up on social media and we can even maybe find you an adventure of your own. Thanks for joining us on Midwest Adventures. I'm Joe, see you in a bit.